tutorial i will show you how to generate spwl sinusoidal pulse wave modulation signal in civilian okay uh, for that browse library and under sources uh, only some block uh, like repeating sequence block and uh, secondly signal generator block okay signal generator block and repeating sequence and we need a max and under sync obviously we need scope okay uh, this is the preliminary requirement and i'm referring a book as me source okay uh, this is the scenario uh, from which i will generate spwm signal and we need a repeating sequence like this and two sign it on uh, two sign it of, of inverse amplitude okay now generate this under repeating sequence in output values we firstly we need one zero sorry then one then minus one and then again zero as you can see here uh from the figure first is zero plus one and uh, then minus one and then again zero okay and uh, this is time zero of oh, one this is one fourth and this is uh uh three fourth and this is uh, the time interval okay here under time values <coughs> when output value is zero time value is zero uh, when one uh, let's take fs by four where fs is the switching frequency okay and when time uh, when output value is minus one again uh, it should three four three four of the uh, time interval okay and um, finally one over fs okay uh, that's all you need click okay and signal generator under signal generator uh, with a sign -in. frequency uh, let's take uh, 6 cr uh, okay and again copy this by dragging this uh, uh, right side of your mouse okay double click and frequency is there okay uh, we need a gain block to reverse it okay minus one so this is our first signal and this is our second signal and okay. then we need a relation of order block double click on the canvas and type relation of okay this is the relation of order and first input is our repeating sequence and i'm taking from and go to block first so you can double click and write from and go to uh, here this yeah, this was our first sign up and i'm setting it here sign up and this is the uh, first get pulse of first get pulse okay? okay and again copy this uh, the relation of part or uh, again the first input is the repeating sequence and copy the go to block drag it here and similarly and rename it as like b similarly b okay uh, this is our second get pulse if you want to uh, check whether this works or not uh, we need to uh, we need to subtract this uh, get one and get get four pulse okay for that i am taking a uh, add block and list of sign is plus minus And this is our first get pulse and this is our second get pulse okay and our score block uh, before subtracting this we have to convert this uh, a boolean data to double data okay type data type conversion and drag it here and change it to double value and click ok and 
so uh, the subtracted output will look like this okay and i'm going matlab and assign fs equal 1000 okay and go to simulink stop time as one and run this model as you can see the output is uh, not uh, looks good okay because this is because of uh, model parameter go modeling and under model setting solve one details and reduce the max step size like 1 e minus 5 okay and click okay and run this simulation okay now you can see uh, this is uh, the uh, desired output as you can see here uh, this is the simplest way you can uh, generate spwm signal uh, for your inverter uh, or any other uh, purposes okay that's all for today thanks for watching